Hi, today we're talking uh, laptops and laptop chargers. Okay, customer bought in their laptop and uh, it was dead. Okay, it wouldn't switch on, no lights, no nothing. Uh, they said they tested the charger with the multimeter and it was outputting 19 volts. So, in their opinion, their charger was okay. So, this charger is 19 volts um, and 4.7 amps. Okay, so. We're just gonna give a test. And there you go. So, customer's right. It does give out the 19 volts that it says it should be giving out. Okay. I plugged in another charger, and the laptop came on. So it proved that although this charge is giving out 19 volts, it's not giving out enough amps. To, um, to power on the thing so you don't only need volts you need your volts and you also need your amps are very important okay so to prove this okay I've got an ammeter here okay this ammeter I'll power it with this battery okay and basically what I've done is connect that to your laptop connect the charger to here because the ammeter has got to run within the circuit, okay? It's running, it's bridged over the negative uh, wire. Okay, so we plug that to the laptop. Plug in the charger. And here we should get, I mean the battery, even when the laptop's off, the battery's charging, we should get some, uh, some amps. And uh, we've got nothing. So you've got 19 volts and you've got a couple of amps. I plug this into a baby Toshiba, which doesn't draw any amps. And it was pulling like 0 0.01 amps. It's just not working. Okay. All right. So I've got my another charger here. Exactly the same charger. 19 volts, 4.7 amps. Okay. It's a replacement charger. Let's unplug the faulty one. Plug in the good charger. Okay. So straight away we're getting a reading on the ammeter. All right. Now if we Switch on the switch on the machine, and there you go. All right. So this will, as the machine switches on and all the lights and the charge, and it will pull power for the charge in the battery. Right now we're looking at three, three point two amps. Okay. Okay. So just because your charger has given out the right voltage, it doesn't mean always that there's not a problem with the charger okay the amps also have to be tested okay so uh, we're gonna replace this charger and this laptop will be back on the road the customer thought it was a burnt motherboard a nice easy fix thanks for watching and remember there's always a fix